You know, Burst is probably better than Overdrive, yeah, objectively. But it's also not available everywhere. I feel like I would rather have a slightly worse version available everywhere than something that is better but not always available. So, like, in my world, I mean, that makes Overdrive more consistent because you can make use of it. You can, like, pick and choose when to use it. You can do that with Burst, but Burst might not be available at certain points, so that... Makes, to me at least, I feel like that just makes Overdrive, even if Overdrive is worse on paper, I think that makes it better. Just because you can use it whenever you want, even if it's just two characters. And like I said, it's a personal thing. I like synergy stuff. I like dual char characters, dual stuff, like doing dual techs of some kind. It's awesome. It's always really cool. You can never go wrong with it. Oh, we're definitely gonna like do some kind of combination move. You muted Ellie. Who do you think you are? Fucking storm. Get wrecked. Go level 78, let's go. Insulating tape. Savory opinion. Dragon vision? That sounds awesome. Is that better than invigorate? It is. I think it's better than invigorate, to be honest. Is you gold? I wish you had a thing that increased gold. You know what? Put Igus on. Gives you a bit less ATS, but giving you immunity would be a good idea. And also, you get some gold from it. And we get Dark Matter back. I'm going to give you, I can't give you these because these aren't leveled up enough. This isn't only, is this only wind? It's only wind. Alright, there's not really much I can do here, but dark matter is good enough. Well, I don't know. I guess we're done with this dungeon. We'll move on and see what happens. Like the boss or something. Probably will be a boss of some kind. Yeah, we made it. Uh, yeah, it's half floor. But there's no sound of Kia or Arios. I feel the sense this the last time I was here. But I believe there's a hidden area behind that large mirror. There is? Yes, the spiritual energy is flowing there as if being drawn inside. Which likely makes it our final destination. It must be. Not FD, I hate that stage. In Smash. What do you know? We actually managed to catch up to them. Yeah. SSS, ready your weapons. We're taking Kia back no matter what. Right. Yes. Roger will go. Roger will go. Oh, Randy. Is there anything down here? There might be. We got down this little staircase here.
Is this the way back? Am I going back? I think I'm just going back, aren't I? Probably I'm going back. Yeah, I just went back. Alright. That's what I thought. The theme actually reminds me of something out of Tales of Symphonia. This sounds like a Tales of Symphonia theme. Maybe that's why I said Lloyd's name instead of Reen's name when I was talking about Reen. Because I was listening to this track and it gives me Tales of Symphonia vibes. Granted, I just realized, this protagonist is named Lloyd, so... I was probably talking about Reen and saying Lloyd's name because the game I'm playing right now, we're playing as Lloyd. And he has the combination moves. So, yeah. Hey, particles of light are being drawn to the mirror. Looks like stepping into the mirror will take us straight into it. Kia, we're coming. Step inside. Yeah, the chat immediately notices it too. There is a Lloyd right in front of me, which I didn't realize. Is that? What the hell? But why? Well, well, well. Marry a bell. Fancy seeing you here. Not really. We expected this. With the whole mayor thing. Mayor become, or yeah. Kia. Mayor becoming president. Adios. Kia, Arios. Yeah, okay. I'll just let Lloyd do the voice acting. Everyone. Secretary Macalain. So you finally come. Bell, explain yourself. I just don't understand why you're doing this. You got a lot of explaining to do, woman. Also, you got... You know, you know, this actually fits you. This fits. Isn't it obvious? As a rightful descendant of the Croy family, the inheritors of the goddess treasure, it's our only na natural... It's only natural that I carry out the duty bequeathed to me. The goddess treasure. It can't be. You mean like the one they found in Laburl? The Ariole? So you already know of them. That simplifies things. The Septarians, seven treasures bestowed upon mankind by Adios in ancient times past. One of them has been passed down through my family, generation after generation. That is until 1200 years ago. What are you even getting at with this? A set of unfortunate circumstances caused us to lose the divine gift we have been granted. As a result, the Croy family set into motion a grand plan to resurrect our Subterian no matter the cost. The land of Crossbow itself was an essential piece of the algorithm, the foundation for our greatest ceremony yet. Algorithm? Are you referring to whatever system it is that's been exploiting the orbital network? Why, yes I am. It's a feat of magical science, a confluence between orbital engineering and Croy family's alchemy. Without it, such an outlandishly large and complex ceremony could never be feasible. A ceremony made possible through magic and science, as well as alchemy. Now I get it. It's all coming together. Is it though? The alchemists who built Stargazer's Tower supplied the cult with their advanced technology. It was the Kuroi family, wasn't it? For real? That must be the case. The logic adds up perfectly. And that would include the cradle Kia was slumbering in. Naturally, it was delivered to the cult by the Kuroi family hundreds of years ago. We granted them their obje object of worship, and in turn, they did as we bade them. And it's just as I thought. The DG cult was only a tool. One that the Croy family manipulated from the shadows to achieve their own goals. I do, I like stuff like this. I like when stuff like this, like, oh, it was like, oh, this was actually like, uh, this, this whole, like, plot point that you thought was a big deal is actually, like, wasn't really the big threat and everything. And there was something lurking in the shadows. Correct, you could think of the cult as nothing more than an ensemble cast of puppets. Though I doubt the poor deers ever had any awareness of that little fact. Well, how was that? And the backstory for you? Oh, and I should add that Arios here has no prior connections to the Croy family. He's merely endorsing our projects from a professional standpoint as our trustworthy collaborator. What the hell has gotten into you? You really just gonna keep playing make-believe with this chick? 
make believe that how you see it. You're not entirely wrong there. I agree in some respects. Well, I never. But even so, they possess the power required to bring about the change I see. So long as that's the case, I'll gladly go along with this little fantasy of theirs. Even if I have to split in the face of our Adios herself to do it. Unbelievable. How could you? I like this music also. This is a really good track for having like, hey, revelations revealed. It fits really well. Honestly, this is all a bit too much to take in. <laughs> yeah, Lloyd, you're telling me, man. You have no idea. I'm still not sure what to make of everything we've heard. But I do know one thing. One thing I can say for sure. There's no way in how I'm letting you drag Kia into this delusion. Please, Kia, you have to come back to us. I don't know what lies they put in your head, but you're still the same Kia we all know and love. There's no reason to put yourself through this. You should be with us, smiling, not sitting there in pain. Well, Kia, Lloyd has made his case perfectly clear. What is it that you desire? What's wrong? Kido, what do you think about what it is you really want here? Don't you want to run over to us? Jump into Lloyd's arms to what you always do? Isn't that what you feel safest? Where you feel most at home? That's right. I know you think what you're doing here is for the best. What matters most is your well-being. It always has been. Well, isn't this a tender-hearted moment, Campanella? Yeah, of course. Oh, and the professor dude. Theo Maiden, I think? Yeah, because you're in the suit of armor. Even though we did see under your mask. So you were in league with one another after all. When isn't Ouroboros involved? So now, I prefer to call it a mutually beneficial arrangement. Good day, everyone. I take this to mean that your preparations are complete. But of course, I dare say you'll be pleased with the progress that has been made. The bells, too, are poised to toll. All that remains is to turn the key. I wouldn't be opposed to waiting until your guests have finished up their little melodrama over there. We really should be getting the show on the road. Time's almost up. My, so it is. Here they come. Who are you talking about? Time's almost up for what? Invasion. The Imperial and Republican armies are at our doorstep. No. Why don't you make yourselves comfortable and enjoy the show? Oh, FMV? Tangram Hill. I don't believe this. It's really happening. But the defense force stands no chance of stopping them. Correction, we already have the key to doing so. She's right there. Oh, what, Kia? President Croy, 
To our guests from the Society, you have my deepest gratitude for cooperating with our project. You as well, Arios, Bell. Everything seems to be proceeding smoothly. Yeah, so far. The rest is in her hands. There you have it, Kia. You understand what you must do, yes? You're the only one who could deliver us from the deliver us from this crisis. Not the nod. Is she gonna power up Vegnagun? Good girl. Oh, Doobly. That's the other, uh, knight girl, because there's like two, there's like three knights, Doobly being one of them, along with the Steel Maiden. Yeah, there's the other one. With Campanella. Colors are really nice. What's going on here? All this converted Obo energy is pouring into Orca's tower. Well, don't do this. I don't know what the hell you're trying to pull off at the end here. We must stop them. Oh, we're gonna fight Arios here? Divine Blade of Wind. If you wish to pass, you'll have to go through me. It seems fair. Com SSS proved to me that you can muster up the strength. The strength to overcome the barrier that Sergei, Guy, and I could not. Don't let them rattle you. It's four on one. Randy, this guy is freaking strong. We have to create an opening somehow. Down system activate. One target to neutralize. Hey, Arios, how's it going? Here we are at last. Ow. Oh, Ellie, you have the, the immunity thing, which is nice. Yo, this music. It's like, um, this was in Zero, but it's like an arranged version. I like it. Very 9k, a level 110, excuse me. A rank bracer turns Secretary of Defense. His true skills shine in his swift sword play. Alright. I missed. Yes. <laughs> Come on, Randy. Stop missing. Hot Gale. Yeah, he's gonna kill me. <laughs> what are the odds that I just got two misses there? Yeah, that 900. That's gonna do a lot. I wonder if I need to win this fight. Or not. Maybe this is another case of a Sigmund fight where you can win and you don't have to, you just get like DP or something. Do an S craft, see if it does something. I just got two misses with Lloyd and Randy. And then Spark Nine didn't do a lot.
It's so little. Yeah. Seems like a fight I could win, but it's just like I'm not meant to win. Like I get DP from it. Because I'm doing very little damage here. Oh, Fujin's Fury. It's over. Yeah, honestly, just kill me. 